Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm back with yet another tutorial video on App Guide. In today's video, I'll show you how you can recover your Skype account which you have forgotten or lost a password to. So, you used to use your Skype to video conference and video call your friends and families, but unfortunately, you have lost the password to that account and you can't access that account anymore. So, you're trying to figure out how you can recover your account, you have clicked on the right video. Today, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'll show you how you can recover your Skype account in very easy steps. So watch the video till the end and you'll do it in no time. Now in order to recover your Skype account, what you need to do is open the Skype application in your Windows. Once you open the Skype application, you will have an interface like this. Here you will have all the accounts that you have logged in the Skype application with. So choose the account that you want to recover and click on the account. Once you select the account, you will land on an interface like this. Here you will be asked to enter your password to the Microsoft account. But we don't have the password to our Microsoft account, so what we'll do is click on the forgot password option. Once you click on the forgot password option, you'll land on an interface like this. Here you'll be asked whether you have the access to the email or phone number which you use to create your Microsoft account with. Now if you have the access to that Microsoft account, click on get code. Then Microsoft will send a code to your email or phone number respectively. Go to that email or phone number and enter the code. Once you enter that code, click on the next button. Now you land on the reset password interface. Here you can create a new password for your Skype account. So go ahead and create a new password for your account. Once you create and confirm your new password, click on the next button. That's it. You have successfully recovered your Skype account. Now you can sign in with that Skype account using a new password and enjoy video conferencing or video calling your friends and families. So that will be it for today's video. Hope this video was helpful for you. If it was, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.